Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how you can remove any unused audio events from your Cubase projects. You might want to do this if you're, say, sharing the project online or archiving it in an online storage or even just on a, another hard drive and you've got everything finalized. One word of caution would be that if there's a potential that, say, you have different vocal takes and you don't want to lose those alternative vocal takes for revisiting the project or guitar takes or bass or whatever it happens to be. Make sure that you have a full backup of the project folder before you do this. In this case, I'm going to be sending this project to somebody online. So at the minute, it's sitting at 1.49 gigabytes, so basically 1.5 gigabytes. And I'm going to see if I can get it sort of down in size a little bit. I think most of the file size on this project is being taken up by the vocal tracks, different vocal takes. So if I go up to media and then open pull window, and then from here, I can go right click and then remove unused media. And I'll go to trash. And then from there, I'm going to empty the trash. And let's see what the size difference is now. So it's gone down to 865 megabytes. So much, much better. So yeah, that is how you remove unused media from your project. And obviously this project's still playing back perfectly fine. So cool. Hopefully you find this tutorial helpful and I'll be back with more videos soon. Cheers.